Welcome to the Hypertherm Cutting Institute XPR Weekly Check Sheet informational video. This short video will cover the steps that need to be taken to complete the XPR Weekly Check Sheet. By performing the weekly checks, you can be sure to find small problems before the impact production. These checks also help ensure good cut quality and longer problem-free operation. This video covers weekly checks for the XPR system, but does not include other weekly checks that may be suggested by the table manufacturer or other components that you may have installed on your cutting system. Start by examining the hoses, cables, and leads. Look for burns, rubbing, kinks, and improper installation. Also look for loose connections at each end of all the hoses and cables, but be sure not to over tighten these connections. Next, perform the gas leak tests. By using the CNC or web interface tool, you may perform the automatic leak test to confirm there are no leaks and all the valves are working correctly. This will allow you to fix any problems that could affect your cut quality or machine reliability in the middle of the cutting operation. The results from the leak test will be posted in the error log screen if you are using the web interface tool. If you are not using the web interface tool, the results should be posted on the CNC screen. You may need to contact the manufacturer of the CNC for more information. The last item you will need to look at is the coolant flow. This may be available on the CNC or by using the web interface tool with a supported wireless device. If you are using the web interface tool, the coolant flow will be found on the power supply page along with the other power supply data. The coolant flow parameters are also listed. More information on using the web tool is available in the XPR 300 instruction manual. This concludes our video on performing the weekly check sheet for the XPR plasma power supply. Thank you for watching this video. For more XPR videos and more, please log on to the Hypertherm Cutting Institute.